Deshaun Holmes is a new head coach for Henrico football. Let's go on the hop. Let's go. All on the 20. Take the field with some urgency. Let's go. Execute. Tempo. Oh, for me, it's still surreal. You know, me being a head coach for the first time at the Helms and Rico High School, uh, being mentored by Coach Glasgow, and you know, and then you know the staff, you know, Coach Vance and Coach Mason, the assistant head coaches, and things in that nature. Being a head coach now, you, there's a lot of things that come with the responsibility. So, but I'm excited for the season. These guys have been putting in a lot of work, and um, we're just ready for the kickoff. When the Warriors do kick off, quarterback Lavelle Winston will operate a wide open aerial attack. Quarterback one is Lavelle Winston. Call him Kool Aid. Uh, he's Coming up from his JV year to his uh, junior year, well, sophomore year from JV coming to his junior year, uh, learning the offense. And like I said, this is year two for him. So we see the actual uh, adding the tears to the layer of the cake. And we actually see him getting a lot better. Coach Jones would like to get Henrico back to when the green and gold was a powerhouse. During the offseason, during the spring, we've been showing our guys a lot of 90s uh, Henrico football tape. Uh, you know, me being a Holland Springs guy, you know, for me, you know, coming over here sometimes was kind of fearful at times. So we're kind of trying to show these guys what the 90s and Riker was all about, show the crowd, I mean, show the players, you know, the crowd atmosphere and, and uh, you know, what it was like to be a Henrico Warrior and a Henrico football player. So we're just showing them, you know, the Henrico guys, the guys who played for us, who played before us, who wore the green and gold, and showing them the meaning behind uh, the green and gold aspect of Henrico football. In 2023, the Warriors are young, but not without experience. Uh, we got about five guys, five or six guys returning on the offensive side about five on the defensive side. We're still kind of young, uh, but I think overall from the past couple of seasons, we kind of played a lot of young guys. They have a lot of varsity experience now moving forward to their junior and senior year. The Warriors have installed a brand new defense that looks to get after it on Friday night. Defensively, we're moving on to a whole different uh, style of scheme, so we've kind of been a lot, doing a lot of building with that and reshaping and redefining the, uh, the culture as far as what we want to be as far as defensively uh, here in Henrico. As long as I'm at the helm, I want us to be known for a physical defensive team. Make no mistake, this season is all about the seniors and the Warriors returning to their winning ways. Get a signature win. Get a signature win that puts us back on track. Uh, and for us, man, we're doing it for our seniors this year, the 24 class. We need to, we need to do it for them. Um, these guys have been in the program for four years now, and they don't even know what the playoffs look like or they don't even know what a winning season looks like. For So for us, making sure our seniors leave with the winning season but also leave with the playoff, get into the playoffs, and at least get a playoff win. The Warriors' first chance at a signature win is September 1st against Hermitage. One, two, three, kill, kill. kill. Hey, yeah.